To start this tutorial, I am taking a foundation. I'm taking L'Oreal's Infallible Foundation in the shade Porcelain. And I'm just going to use my Real Techniques buffing brush to apply this all over my skin. Then for concealer and to highlight my skin a little bit because Natalie's skin was absolutely flawless in this um, show, I used Urban Decay's Naked Skin Concealer in the shade Fair Neutral and I applied this underneath my eyes in a triangle shape and then used Real Techniques Pointed Foundation Brush just to blend this out. And I use my fingers as well, just to make it a bit more seamless and blend it out. And then I just added a little bit to that little needle and blighter at my chin. To set the concealer and the foundation, I used Makeup Forever's HD powder and my Sephora mineral powder brush. Then for my eyebrows, I use Soap and Glory's Archery Eyebrow Pencil in the shade Blonde Shell. I use this bully end to brush my brows into place and then just use the pencil to fill in any sparse gaps. You don't want to really over define your brows, you just want them to look very natural. But since my eyebrows don't have much of a tail, I just added them in and then just use the spoolie end to brush back through just to make it a little bit more natural. To prime my eyes, I used Rimmel's Lasting Finish Concealer in Porcelain and just blend it out over my eyes using my fingers. And then I set it into place using Bourjois Healthy Balance Powder in the shade Vanilla. We're not going to be doing too much with the eyes today. We're just going to give our eyes a little bit of definition and I'm taking this MAC eyeshadow malt on my Sephora crease shadow brush and just applying that through my crease as I said just to give my eyes a little bit of definition then for eyeliner I'm using this one from Makeup Forever and I'm just running this along my tight line just to make my lashes look a little bit thicker you don't have to do this if you don't want to then I curled my eyelashes And then used L'Oreal's Volume Million Lashes Mascara in the Feline uh, edition and just coated my upper lashes in a couple of coats. For blush I used Clinique's Cheek Pop in the colour Melon Pop and using my Look Good Feel Better blush brush I just applied this to my cheeks. I applied this quite low down compared to where I would normally do this because it looked, kind of looked like she was almost contoured with it. Then for my lip colour I used Maybelline's Colour Sensational Lipstick in Peach Poppy. Then I blotted it just a little bit just to mattify it down a bit and then just applied another coat of that lipstick. And that's it. You're done.